Hi everybody. Uh, as you know, the Supreme Court of India has uh, recently banned uh, sun control films from all types of vehicles on the Indian roads. And uh, most of us are on a mad rush to get uh, the sun films removed uh, uh, from our uh, vehicle to meet the deadline set by the, the Supreme Court. Usually the car service agents charge uh, anywhere between uh, 200 to 500 rupees to get uh, films removed from cars. And sometimes it's even 1000 rupees if you have a luxury vehicle. In fact, uh, removing the sun film from a car is, is not at all a difficult uh, thing. You can do it yourself and it doesn't require too many tools. Um, let me explain to you what all things you need uh, in order to get um, sun films removed from your cars. First you need uh, this one. It's a paint scraper and uh, what you need is uh, uh, a thin one which is flexible like this and not the one which you painters use to apply for tea. That is a thick one, the thin one and this costs just 5 rupees. Just 5 rupees in the Indian market and uh, you need one of this. And then you need a, a sprayer, a spray bottle and uh, since I don't have one I use a, you know old uh, hand wash soap spray bottle which is kind of uh, available at any, any home and then you need uh, regular liquid dishwash uh, soap and uh, what you have to do is you have to pour in uh, say around 5 milli of this say, say a spoon of this into this and we need to fill water in this uh, probably the last thing you need uh, is uh, a regular old style razor blade uh, which sometimes is useful to you know cut through the film on the edges now let's move on to the car and see how we remove this so this is uh, our garage uh, i'll be removing uh, sun film from this car let's get uh, started with uh, removing the film from uh, the driver side window which is which i opened just now what I'm doing is I have uh, lowered the window a bit so that I can peel off uh, the stuff from the top. Let's see how do we do it. Okay, so now we are going to use a little razor blade to just uh, take off the edges of the film, and you can see it. See, you can see it peeling off easily. And films like 3M will come like this. And you have to make sure that you are taking it in, a, in in one go so don't tear up the phone and there is a tip here if you have parked your car longer in sunlight it is going to easily peel off so you can see it's coming out once it is come out in a way that you can grip it is uh, you know you can just pull it off Okay, now we got uh, enough grip here, so what I'm going to do is I'm going to um, push up the window so that you can peel off all stuff. You can see that it's all come out and I'm going to do the same thing on all the four windows. So to make things easier for the, the rear window uh, cleanup, we will just remove all those backrests. Or rather headrests. Okay. Now here there is a tip. We can see all this uh, defogger 
um, filaments running through into the, the, the rear windshield. You don't want to disturb or cut through any of them. So what you have to do is, uh, you pick an area where it is not um, there and then make your mark again. So I can't find any here which is easily peelable. Okay, I just make a cut through this so that I can pull out the film here from this side. If you can do it from the uh, sides, that is the best. You can see it coming off. I'm now going to take it in two pieces actually. So I'll be running through this. No need, Ali. As much as possible, uh, you have to pull it off in one go so that we don't need to worry about scraping it off near the places where you can't reach. Now we can see that uh, even after removing the film, there are some kind of patches like this. Can you see this? Uh, it's not very clear on the video. Maybe uh, like this. And these are the areas which we need to clean up using the uh, scraper blade and uh, the solution that we prepared. Let's see how we do it. First we spread a little uh, dirty cloth along the area where we are cleaning so that uh, we don't mess up the other parts of the car. Then what we are going to do is spray a little bit of our solution here. Just shake a bit. Spray a little bit. And uh, we are going to now remove the stain just like this. You need to keep an angle like this and you can see all the stains removing easily without causing any kind of scratches on your um, windows. Then after that is done, you just wipe it off. And you got to do this on all areas where there is some amount of, uh, you know, gum stains remaining. See, the car is, the, the, the window is now bit polished and clean. Yeah, so the rear side is where uh, it's a little bit complicated to do it because uh, you don't have much space to bend into. On hatchbacks, uh, things are a bit simpler. You can open the back door and you know get things done. But here we should be a little bit careful. Okay, now what you have to do here is scrape it in a way that your blade is going parallel to the 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 heating filaments heating element of the car so that you don't break it i mean it, it doesn't get broken easily but you know still you can hurt you know sometimes okay see here we have removed it all the way here and just nicely wipe it off to glaze it so that's it this is what you have to do on the remaining parts of the car so it's all done now and uh, we can push back our uh, headdress in their respective places. And that's it. You are good to go. So this is how it uh, looks finally nice and clean. All the windows with no sun film on it.